crash land. <laughs> We're on the tram now. Goodbye, people. On the top. Not moving yet, but. Look, it's Tesco, it's Augusta. And the shark over there. I'm the sound again. We're moving! Goodbye, people! Bye, people! My butt's wet! <laughs> My butt's cold! <laughs> so we're moving now. On the track we're now the old uh, seat to seat junction uh, railway oh, wow. the station at seaton was to the site on your right there right at the very top on the seafront wow. there were people who came down by train in the 40s 50s 60s nearly 70s came to this big site on your right not to shop at tesco's but here captain warner opened the biggest holiday camp in europe on the 5th of May, 1935. Wow. There were 2,000 campers on that site on your right-hand side. This is I now see part of Tesco's development, which includes 300 new homes going up. The first phase is another 300 to go up, and then there'll be a hotel built. The big building you saw on the left-hand side, the brand new wooden building, that's a new Jurassic exhibition that will open in uh, April 2016. All the sand here had to be bought on site, because the building inspector yeah, told Tesco before you could start building wet. any so development, you've got to take the ground level up to what the flood plain will be Leeds in Bridge. 20 years' time. But you'll see the sign in a minute. The size of Tesco is a very strong financial position, not like they are now. Wow! Cow! They had to build a platform one mile out to sea, connected to a pipeline, and for three months, 24-7, dredges that's came in, pumping the sand that is a into the okay, site here by the pipeline. That's not a right, problem. This is our depot. Look, it's cheap. When British Rail closed the line here, 1966, and Dr. Beachy, uh, I'm holding it as tight as I can, I'm holding it by the wings. Of, uh, because they all okay. built their own box carts. My butt's cold! My butt's cold! And for yeah. tuppence, they'd be more than happy to carry a bag around to Captain Warner's uh, other yeah, The white right building up there is the lookout point for the uh, Royal Navy during the 70s. Oh, I always touched it. And his shipping because they thought they were going to That's now private. Ah, that would have got touched it. And the electric chop hole. <laughs> Look at the other tram. Is this like spe it's a special car. It's not a tram, it's a special car. Okay. Slowing down. River. Oh yeah, look. So there's weather. This is wet. This reminds me of the wet. Oh, that's cold. <laughs> we stopped. You will now look at the tree for the next one, then. <laughs> <laughs> the phone. Look, look at the trees. <laughs> There's the pole. And uh, here's me. Hi. Rabbits. This one's gonna go on until we get reach our destination. Back to home. Uh, upside down face. <laughs> <laughs> upside down, not your face. Yeah. 
Please mind your head. No, I don't want to mind my head because my head is mine. And it has a mind, so I don't want to mind my head. <laughs> Look, you see the cheek. I'm trying not to drop this. It's gone up for five minutes now. Very, very beautiful part of the country. They say there's more birds and wildlife in this area than you'll find outside the ocean exits on a Saturday Sorry, night. Sorry, I can't so hear you. Over. Largest birds are the cormorants and the herons. Yeah. There's 35 different type of waving bird in the X-Valley. We're passing another train with our next uh, passing loop.